This is a search for saplings following a letter about new trees being planted in Thornbury. That letter appeared in the local paper and was written by Sue Aitken, chairman of award-winning Thornbury in Bloom. Sue Aitken is also a local business man and an all-round jolly good egg. Here is the letter as printed in the Thornbury Gazette. Ms Aitken offered to send the details to those interested. I was interested. Eventually the details arrived by email. Of 40 new trees, five had been planted by Thornbury in Bloom. At the junction of Butt Lane and Gloucester Road, a European pear. On Morton Way, a northern red oak, a common beech and a sweet chestnut and between Grosen Road and Avon Way, another oak. So off I went looking for them, and this is where I thought they all were. Continue watching, and you'll find out how well I did. First, the European pear. For the location, it just had to be this tree. And I was right. Now for the Northern Red Oak on Morton Way. Maybe this tree? Yes! Another success! The beech tree next. A bit easy peasy. For the leaves, it must be this one. Correct again, I'm on a roll. Next, the sweet chestnut. What does a young, leafless, sweet chestnut look like? This? Yes! Once more, another success notched up. Four down, one to go. Now for the other oak. A northern red oak, wasn't it? Can't be round here with these stumps, surely. This is open space on the final section of Avon Way before Grovesend Road. But is it this tree, near to three stumps? No! Wrong location, wrong tree type. 
4 out of 5. So where was the other tree and what kind of tree was it? Fortunately, Chairman Sue was at hand to put me right. It was actually an English oak located on the open space beyond Dovedale. Well that's good to know. I would not want to think that our wonderful Thornbury in bloom was in some way associated with planting one tree where three had been cut down. That wouldn't do at all. So off I went to the right location. Here it is with its dead oak leaves from last year still clinging on. Success finally. It's quite a big open space. I'd never been here before. There's the new tree over there. Let's see what else there is. Oh, what's that? Oh no, it looks like the remnant of a tree. Surely not. Anyway, just a one-off. There won't be any others, you can be sure of that. Oh no, what's that? It may be cut right down at ground level, but that is a tree stump. Let's take another look at the other one. Still cut at ground level, but less neatly, and still a tree stump. Yes, it's a special Thornbury one for two deal. Why have two trees? where just one will do. The fact that there has been a reduction in the number of trees by one in this area must have slipped Chairman Sue's mind when she gave this balanced factual account. See the video about the nine South Gloucestershire Council trees to see how well they served the people of Thornbury.